this much, I know. <laughs> uh, today I'm going to make some blackberry jam because near my work there is a bunch of blackberry bushes. I should have picked more, but <laughs> life is what life is, you know. So start off with by adding these to a nice saucepan. And uh, there is maths to it, you like one third blackberry, one part sugar, but me, I tend to just chuck it all in, you know. Life is meant to be adventurous. And for me, I find out food comes out better that way, because you're not thinking about it too much, you're just going with the flow. Just try not, eh, let's chuck it all in, why not? Chuck them all in there, there we go. And then you want this. Is that my one? Uh, better be sick, I forgot an uh, instrument for the cooking. Yeah, sorry about that, I forgot the major. Uh, I forgot the major. <laughs> oh, I borrowed someone else's. So yeah, you want to squish down your blackberries. I'm probably better off doing that with a spoon or a fork. Just squish them down, yeah. Squish them in, squish it. I should really got a wick or something for it. Yeah, that would work a bit better. Squish them all down because it releases the juices, which is good for the jam. And then you want to add some sugar because blackberries are natural in, I can't pronounce the word, pectin which is good for jams so it helps uh, break everything down make it all go down so it's nice and squidgy it's gonna look like a bird and someone at the end of this <laughs> kind of how my boss wanted the bird to be today though it's pretty funny just stressing them out all the time just need to take a chill pill to be fair I might make some more jam on the weekend because uh, I'm still at work on the weekend. <laughs> yeah, one of them jobs in a work on the weekend. Work every day. Squidge all down. Squidgey, squidgey, squidge. <laughs> Try and get all the, all the big bits down to little bits. Uh, you can squid it more whilst cooking, so that's what I'm going to do. Now you want to add some lemon juice to it. Probably not too much, just a smidge. Adds to the flavour and that brings it all out. The zesty. Then you want to add some sugar. Although you can do it like low sugar, but I'll keep my sweetness levels up, you know. Keep it all up. And you want to put some heat on, so let's say five. Yeah, five. Uh, it should be cooking, and I'll get back to you shortly. Just gonna let that heat up a bit. Uh, so now that that's bubbling. I had to put it up the heat a little bit. Just got to stir it. Just keep stirring it and crushing it down. So it breaks it down into little bits. Might need my spoon for this. I use um, 
improvising because I don't actually have a crush of things. So, <laughs> otherwise, they end up with bits in the jar. Well, there's nothing wrong with bits, but I'm trying to make it bitsless. It's going to go in sandwiches and stuff. Switch it all down. Switch. Um, you want the the jam to gel, and if it's not gelling later on, uh, you would put it on lower heat and just let it simmer for a bit, and then it should get into the process of gelling. But for me, I'm putting it in high heat because uh, burn, baby, burn, so to say. <laughs> And I have a problem with smelling things, but I am smelling this. It's pretty strong. <laughs> Probably because it's high temperature and it's like burning a little bit. <laughs> you see it start making a layer on top, like foaming. Just keep stirring and uh, break it down into little bits. And I shall get back to you when we have an advancement. Because at the moment it's just bubbling. <laughs> So I think that is just about ready for me. Got it all in my hands. <laughs> and you can jar jam for quite a while. Uh, some people put marge and butter, like a little bit, but I'm gonna leave it like that. Cause I'm gonna spend it, uh, I'll spend it, I'm gonna use it in a couple of days. I think some jam sandwiches to work. <laughs> oh, and uh, I'd like to do a shout out to a Mrs. Katie Lund who gave me the idea of uh, this jam making after me and her made some jam. <laughs> Our one was a bit better because uh, she was leading the way on that one. <laughs> Everything she does is a bit better than me to be fair. <laughs> I don't mind, like, because I'm proud of what she does. Uh, you should look up her channel as well. She's got some good videos, and there is parts of mine on there, but her part to it, if that made sense. So, uh, yeah, until next time, I'm going to leave you and enjoy myself with this jam. Might mix it with noodles. I'll let you know. <laughs> Uh, catch you guys later. Ciao.